Prophecy fulfilled, the sun darkened. Prophecy, Amos 8 verse 9. In that day, declares the Sovereign Lord, I will make the sun go down at noon and darken the earth in broad daylight. Fulfillment, Matthew 24 verse 29. Immediately after the distress of those days the sun will be darkened, and the moon will not give its light, the stars will fall from the sky, and the heavenly bodies will be shaken. Additional References Acts 2 verse 20 The sun will be turned to darkness, and the moon to blood before the coming of the great and glorious day of the Lord. Revelation 6 verse 12 I watched as he opened the sixth seal. There was a great earthquake. The sun turned black like sackcloth made of goat hair, the whole moon turned blood red. Context of the Prophecy Amos prophesied about a day when the sun would go down at noon and the earth would be darkened during broad daylight. Significance of the Fulfillment Apocalyptic Events The fulfillment of Amos' prophecy is seen as part of apocalyptic events that accompany the end times. Eschatological Sign In Matthew 24, Jesus references the darkening of the sun as a sign of the coming of the Son of Man and the culmination of history. Symbolic Meaning The sun's darkening is symbolic of cosmic upheaval and God's judgment. Implications and Reflections Prophetic Accuracy The fulfillment of this prophecy underscores the accuracy of biblical prophecies. Eschatological Warnings The darkening of the sun serves as an eschatological warning and points to the culmination of God's plan. Divine Sovereignty The cosmic events remind us of God's sovereignty over creation and history. Conclusion Amos' prophecy of the sun going down at noon and the earth being darkened finds fulfillment in various biblical accounts, including Matthew 24, Acts 2, and Revelation 6. This cosmic event is a significant marker in eschatological discussions, symbolizing the coming of the Son of Man and the culmination of God's plan for humanity. It serves as a reminder of God's sovereignty and the fulfillment of prophetic words.